So now we're gonna finish up uh, the knowledge transfer. We go back to our stronghold. Ba -ba -bam. It's the next day. Eight hours have passed. It's now four six. I'm gonna go to management. Now go to knowledge transfer. Boom. Transfer knowledge complete. Boom, boom. It's gonna take you to some creepy room. Just look at the book. Let it load. Yeah, this book right here. And I should, when everything is done and I wake up, I will be in burn, I believe. Okay, boom. We've woken up. We're back online. And we are now inside of Vern, I believe. We have to set up our class, okay? Boom, we're gonna go to, I usually use max roll, and look for a decent build here. So I usually use max roll. You go to the website, you click Lost Ark. And we're gonna go Warrior. Just need a basic Warrior build. Berserker. Uh, we're gonna go Mayhem, because Mayhem is the meta build right now. Everyone's going at super strong. Okay, and uh, this is basically gonna tell me what I'm gonna look for. I need a lot of crit, and I need swiftness. Crit, swiftness. And okay. you just hit this little slider. Boom, 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 to about the points that you have. Okay. Gonna move this to the other screen, and just do that. Yeah, I sped this up to so save us some time. These are the skills and runes I'm using. This is also the skill order that I have at the bottom of my thing currently. So the first time that you do the knowledge transfer to get to Vern, they'll give you a set. But that won't happen with the other with the other knowledge transfer. Alright, and uh okay. So these items you get from the fever event on the weekends. Uh, you get all of the following when you open them. We're gonna open five. Bah, 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 bah. And this is what we're gonna use on this guy to get all the way to tier three. If we need healing, bombs, all that stuff, we have it here. So now we're off. We are level 302. And the first thing you're gonna do is Normally you would go and do your uh, Chaos Dungeons right, but in actuality, the first thing we're going to do is that we're going to start collecting the materials, right? Always. Right, we'll sell M and it goes ready to sale. Set sale, boom, boom, boom. Set sale, we're going to go to Liberty Guild Vessel. Okay, now we're going to use our Pirate Coins. And our sun coins to buy all the upgrade materials that we need. So we're gonna buy. We're gonna just buy it out. Why not? Oop. Okay, just show you. Now, these things are so cheap that you could probably buy the buy them on the market. The harmony shards is what I would definitely buy here. Um, but I'm just gonna show you guys so you guys know where to get it. Whenever you guys are leveling, or maybe some of you guys didn't know that you can get that there. Uh, okay, so then we're gonna head right back in here. Doc, we're gonna take the triport to Vern Castle. Okay, and we're gonna go here now. We're gonna clean up all the vendors. We won't even have to do a dungeon in the first, the first thing. We're gonna try to get as high item level as we can, and then we're gonna do the, uh, the dungeons. This is another reason why you should start on Tuesdays because today is currently Wednesday, right? So, and tomorrow the whole thing resets. So the pirate shop that I just bought out and this lady who I'm going to buy out right now, right? I'm going to buy everything she has. Boom. Correct. Is there anything else I can buy? Uh, why not? I'll buy this too. Boom. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna buy out all the honing materials that she has. Boom. I'm gonna buy all the honing materials that she has. Everything. You see how the materials that I bought, it's uh it's you can't buy anymore after a certain amount. Right here it tells you the roster limit. Eight, right? And right here it tells you it's gonna reset in 15 hours. That's tomorrow. This is why you want to do it. Start on Tuesday, and then by Wednesday, you're in this stage and you can buy these out. Tomorrow, you're going to be able to buy these again 
So you, it's like you're getting two ma double materials in one week, right? And that applies for um, the pirate shop as well. And it also applies for this other vendor right here where I'm going. Boom, boom, boom. This is the event going on right now. We're going to buy out all of these materials here. Boom, boom, boom. Exchange. Boom, boom. Exchange. Boom, boom. Okay. Now look at all the materials we have. And we've just... We haven't even gotten into anything. You know, this is another vendor here. If it gets bad, we will also do the chaos sh uh, farming to see if we can get further. We'll buy this out as well. Um, there are also other ma other ways to get materials. Just in case you guys are wondering, you can go here and you can buy the honing materials that you need. And this is why you should prioritize harmony shards. They're probably the most expensive things you're gonna buy. Um, after that, okay. And then the final way that we can get some materials is this way right here. And I'm gonna put up a list of every place that you can get materials, like I said. And here it is. Boom, it's the tower. So, the first time that you run the tower, you're gonna have different materials. I'll, I'll grab an image and I'll put it up of what you get for completing the towers. So the second time, that you do the same floor, the, the rewards will change. So I've already cleared the tier one tower on my, on my main. So now the rewards are different. Now the rewards are like to help get your next character up. Once we're done with the chaos raids, the garden raids, once we've exhausted the pirate ship, once we've exhausted the guild the shop, once we've exhausted the daily tasks um, and e everything else, the tower is the last thing you want to do because it's kind of, it can be annoying on some characters and almost impossible on some other characters. All right, so I have to break, I had to break up the second day into different parts because a lot of things happened. Uh, for this video, I just wanted to cover how to complete the knowledge transfer, um, how to set up your character, where to go. You go a max roll, you look up your build guide. It's a great website. And then I wanted to go over all the vendors that you want to hit before the reset. You want to hit the pirate ship, the Grand Prix vendor, and the event raid. If you're feeling a little bit grindy, you can do the chaos vendor before the reset as well. But that's all up to you.